what's up everyone, I'm Ashley and this is Ashley Talks Movies. Welcome to my channel. In this video I'm going to be doing a review of the new film Ammonite, which is about a British fossil hunter by the name of Mary Anning, played by Kate Winslet, who develops an intense relationship with a much younger woman, played by Saoirse Ronan, who is sent to the seaside town to recover from what the film calls a mild case of melancholia. Now before I get into the full review of the film, while I have you here, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my videos, and also hit that notification bell so you get notified every time a new video is posted. Okay? So, on to the review. Ammonite comes from director Francis Lee, who had his directorial debut with 2017's God's Own Country. With Ammonite, he's back with another intimate story uh, between two people. And uh, with this film, he basically takes uh, real life people, Mary Anning, who was a real person, and Charlotte Murchison, um, who's also a real person, and imagines this uh, relationship between these two women. Ammonite is a beautiful, but also dreary and at times very gloomy film. Um, and it might be hard for some people to, to get through because it is rather depressing at times. But I think the film is elevated by the amazing performances from Kate Winslet and Saoirse Ronan. Kate Winslet plays uh, Mary Anning, who was a real life uh, British fossil hunter. Um, she is the type of person who is sort of weathered and beaten down. She's uh, isolated from the scientific community, who, uh, you know, which didn't give her a lot of respect, um, mostly because she was a woman. She's also isolated from other people. She's kind of shut herself um, away from others, with the exception of her mother, who she lives with. And Kate Winslet is able to convey so much of Mary's emotions and feelings just through her face. There's so many, there are so many moments in this film that are without dialogue, and Kate Winslet does such a great job with her facial expressions to, to really convey those emotions and, and those feelings um, in such a brilliant way. And I think this is probably one of her best performances in years. Meanwhile, uh, Sir Sharonin plays uh, Charlotte Murchison, uh, this young woman who um, comes to uh, Lyme Regis, where this, this film is set, um, after uh, uh, suffering um, you know, a tragedy. And uh, she's brought to this uh, seaside area by her husband, who um, basically wants her to recover from melancholia. And the, the two of them strike up this, this relationship. Saoirse Ronan does such a great job with this character. And I feel like it, even though Kate Winslet is doing such a great job, Saoirse Ronan's performance, I think, is slightly uh, better than, than Winslet's performance, only because with the character of Charlotte, she's able to do a lot more because, uh, because Charlotte has a lot more development over the course of the film. Um, and and you, you see a visible change with that character more so than you do with, with, with uh, Mary. Another reason these performances are really great and, and really elevate this film um, is because Kate Winslet and Saoirse Ronan have really great on-screen chemistry. The two of them, it works. And, and the, the ability for them to be able to um, make this relationship believable and, and to really convey sort of this intense passion and, and, and longing um, I think really elevates uh, those performances and again they, they, they work really well on screen together. Cinematography in this film is absolutely gorgeous. I've never been to Lyme Regis, I've never been to England, but watching this film I did really feel transported to this area. You, you get a sense of that from the cinematography with the, with the shots of the cliffs and, and the waves hitting against these rocks and everything is sort of gray and blue. Um, it, you, you do get a sense of it being very isolated, you do get a sense of it, it being sort of bleak, and the cinematography really is able to capture the mood of this film so well. I really love how this film uses metaphors and parallels to really sort of give you a better sense of these characters and who they are and, and what they're feeling, what they're going through. Um, as I mentioned before, Mary is a uh, you know, sort of isolated individual, and she's, she's very closed off from everyone. And, other characters often hint at the fact that she's sort of like created this shell around her. Very much like the fossils 
uh, that she digs up. Uh, and so, you know, that's an interesting sort of parallel between her work and then also herself as a person. You also get interesting parallels between um, Mary and Charlotte and the work that she does with sort of cleaning up these fossils and, and you know, making them beautiful again. And then her having to basically take care of Charlotte um, with such care, again, like she does with her fossils. And just so many interesting, you know, parallels and things that I think really just really make this film uh, really, really beautiful um, and, and makes it really, really amazing. For me, the weakest part of the film was um, the story. I, it's not The story isn't bad by any means, but I think of all the other things that really work well in this film, the story was the weakest link. I think part of it is because it is slow moving and it is so distant at times. It just, it does keep you kind of at a distance with, uh, characters and everything and it does at times feel just almost overwhelmingly bleak what did save this film for me was the last half of this film which uh i think shifts and and the mood sort of changes i mean even the cinematography changes in that it's a lot more colorful and bright and and even the characters have a little bit more life to them and i think that's what really saved this film for me but but again ammonite is a wonderful film. It is, is a really great effort by director Francis Lee. Uh, Kate Winslet and Saoirse Ronan do an amazing job uh, with their performances. So anyway, those are my thoughts on Ammonite. Let me know what you think about the film in the comment section below. While you're here, like this video, give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe so you see more videos like this.